Today's lesson comes from a user comment and the question is how would you manage the state if you had a hundred different booleans and only one of them could be true? Would you manage a hundred different boolean variables? As an example, consider a React UI where we have a hundred different switch components. Now switch components work on top of a boolean and our objective is to manage the state such that there is only one switch component that can be toggled on at any given point in time. Now instead of managing a hundred different booleans for the hundred different switch components, what we really need is one boolean to tell us which particular switch component is toggled on. Now the key thing that is unique to each switch is its index. So to identify which particular switch component is toggled on, we can just manage a selected index, which can either be null in which case nothing is selected, or it can be a number pointing to the currently selected switch index. So we set the boolean value of the switch component to be true if index is equal to the selected index. And whenever the user interacts with the particular switch component, we want to update the selected index to be the index for this particular switch component. And now we have a mutually exclusive set of switch components where only one of them can be true at any given point in time, controlled by the selected index number. Now one additional tweak that we can make to this code is that if a particular switch component is already selected and we click it again, we want that to go into unselected state. We can do that quite easily within our set selected index function. If the current index is equal to the index for this switch component, it means that it is already selected and therefore we should set all of them to false. So we set the selected index to null. Otherwise, this switch component should be the only one that's selected and therefore selected index should be set to this index. And with this change in place, we can toggle off the only selected switch or click on any of the other switches to toggle them on instead of this one. Thank you for joining me. Smash that like and subscribe for more content like this. Leave your burning questions in the comments below and I will see you in the next one.